Nobody wants to be friend zone. Hey guys, Wicked here and welcome to a Clash Clans episode. Today we've got the builder base. Uh, I haven't done my ship on my main account yet, so I wanted to save it for this let's play because I want to max out the builder base with you guys. I want the progression to be on video. So I uh, hope you guys follow this series. Please smack that like button if you want this series to keep going and if you enjoy it. But let's go ahead and uh, get this free rebuild going. And uh, the thing is you need a builder free to actually build it. So let me know in the comments below if you actually had a builder free when this actually happened. So Chief, our boat and crew are ready to set sail. So you would have seen a lot of sneak peeks uh, that, well not really sneak peeks, they're released on the uh, update when it was live. But uh, you would have seen a lot of videos already on my channel of uh, Max uh, Builder Hall 5 already. Um, so go check them out because I do have a few tutorials of uh, what best defenses there are and all that. But this is going to be starting from scratch. So we're going to be newbies already. Um, okay, so here we go. We're going to upgrade this. Upgrade that bad boy. Uh, it's only going to take four seconds um, to upgrade. So there we go. Alright, and here comes the little maidens. Wow, gonna join the party. Where are they going to? They're go oh, they're okay. They're just going to the builder hall. So, uh, don't you think the builder guy, um, the master builder, he looks like he has a yoga mat. So, uh oh, visitors, hooray. Alright. Whoa, where'd you come from? My place, you completely cleaned out. You totally earned yourself a tour. Alright, so this is the Star Laboratory. This is where we research. Uh, we're gonna research the elite. Uh, not the elite barbarians, uh, the rage barbarians. So we got to unlock this special ability. We'll do that. Um, it's only gonna yeah. Let's let's gem that. It's only one gem. Who needs the troops to see who's the best builder around? Of course. So we're gonna keep this account uh, free to play. Uh, we're not gonna mass gem anything. It's gonna be all uh, free to play. Um, except you know, getting gems from the in game, obviously from the the obstacles. So uh, so it wants us to attack. So let's see what we can do here. Um, let's find a, an opponent, get off the zero trophies. Alright, so he's got the double cannon. Oh, this is tough already. So we need to get the double cannon straight away. I imagine there's going to be a, uh, a push trap. Let's imagine there's going to be push trap there. Nope, there isn't. Let's go. Let's get all these bar rage barbarians in there. And once that double cannon is gone, that's pretty much game over. Because there's no other, there's actually no other defenses. So... Build hall's gonna go down. Uh, 80% quickest three star in history. Boom. <laughs> so that's the first uh, first attack with the builder base. Pretty excited about that. Okay, so obviously it's it's a bot because the drop ship and the cannon cart, you can't get it that low. You can't get that low. Alright, here we go. So the suggestions on what sort of upgrades that the uh, master builder wants to start on. Obviously, we don't have the gold at the moment. Mm -hmm. So, you guys already know that the gold and elixir are separate from the main village. This is a one versus one mode, and the only thing that uh, they share is the gems. So, what are we going to do here? Let's have a look in the shop. We don't have enough for the... Uh, we need to keep battling to get some... Uh, yeah, we need to keep battling. So, we've got some defenses. We've got some walls. We've got a push trap. Uh, let's put a push trap in. Let's uh, let's give our cannon a little bit more of a fighting chance. Let's see if there's any more defenses that we can put in. Uh, let's put some more walls. So, what do you guys think about the walls? Do you like them separately, individually, so you can design more custom? Uh, we're gonna we might have to use the gems for that. All right. So here we go. Rotate. Let's get these. Let's get a wall here. We want that cannon to have a fighting chance a little bit longer. I can't remove that stone. Kind of annoying. Uh, let's just leave that there. Push trap can go here. We want to lead him away from the cannon. Alright. Let's see if we can get any more defense. Can we get any more defenses? Alright, we need 12,000 gold. So what we're going to do is we're going to keep attacking because we want to get that uh, uh, loot bonus. El Chapito! Alright, he's just going to cannon, so I'm just going to mass attack this cannon here. And that's going to be a 3 star straight away. I know it's not ex exciting gameplay right now, but it's going to get better guys. Once we get to higher builder halls, um, once we get the battle machine going, it's going to be sick. 
So there we go, 43%. This is actually a real player. El Chapitito from Friend Zone. Nobody wants to be friend zoned, but uh, sorry, El Chapito, we're gonna give you a hundred percent and we're gonna leave you for the night. <laughs> it's just a one night stand. So here we go, El Chapito is down, he's definitely got friend zoned, and uh, let's go see how much loot we got from that. Uh, 5,000 victory bonus and five wow, 5,000 elixir, 30 plus uh, trophies, and 5,000 gold. All right, so the wins here we need three wins. And uh, current win bonus is 5,000. The next one is 10,000. Let's go ahead and uh, let's see if we can get any more defenses. So the more defenses you have, the better chance that you will defend and get uh, more percentage against the other guys. So uh, we need a little bit more. We need so uh, Can we upgrade anything? No, we can't. So we need to keep attacking. We need to get more of that uh, win bonus. All right. Alpaca, Alpaco Armada. All right, where's his cannon at? Oh, his cannon is pretty well defended here. This could be tough. So the shortest route would be uh, here. So hopefully we can get to that cannon straight away. You just got to find the shortest path to the cannon. Oh my goodness. Oh, we had one barbarian. This could take a while. And uh, go, 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 rage barbarian, go, go, rage barbarian, go. He's just tapping on that wall. Tap, tap, tappy with one barbarian but the rage barbarians against the builder halls isn't too bad uh, it's kind of inflated in the builder village area so there we go oh where's the last one we're in darkness guys we are in darkness hey he just saw his head uh, in a statue uh, in the ground there so I'd be freaking out oh he he would have to put the uh, barracks over there Cheeky, cheeky little man. Alright, so we got the barracks now. That's going to get down. And that's going to be a three-star. Boom! Perfect. Let's see how he does against my base here. Alpaca, Alpaca, Armada. And yes, he only got 15% on my base. Let's see what's working on my base right now. And we got a whole lot of loot there. Can we times four this? Alright. That push trap! I told you! That push trap worked! Alright, look. That push trap gave me a little bit of time. Boom! Get out! Get out, son! Look at that. The push trap may have saved the day. And I put that army camp over here so they kind of uh, passed away from the cannon. And well done for Wicked's defense. But let's go defenses. We definitely want to have the double cannon. The double cannon is pretty OP at this level. So let's put the double cannon here. Protect that a little bit. Let's see. Let's path the army camp over here. Uh, let's Okay, let's uh, I need to get rid of some of these obstacles can't do that yet. Okay uh, We need we need a path There we go. That should be good We want to pass them around around the uh, double cannon so I'd rather him to have the builder hall first let's have the cannon here so let's go ahead and do some more attacks get some more of that bonus oh i'm loving this i'm loving this what are you guys thinking of the builder base i know you, you some of you guys are uh, complaining about the loot um but that is natural uh because it's meant to be a casual gameplay where you, you do your few attacks a day to get the bonus collect your gems and upgrade a few things and then you go back to war and farming on your main base so oh this is gonna be bad guys I need to break through here he's I might actually lose this so I might start going for percentage only just because I can't reach that cannon that cannon is too far out but let's let's try to go for percentage okay this could be a problem all right all right, we need some percentage here. I think the best one is to go here, get rid of that army camp. So he just has to he just has to get less than 38%. So I need more troops. I think I need to upgrade to get more uh, troops or get more army camps. But uh, let's see. Yes, we did win that. So let's see the replay real quick. That double cannon would have definitely um definitely gave him some trouble. Yeah, he definitely had a lot more barbarians. There we go. The double cannon 
was the problem for him and that's how I won. Sweet! That's awesome! That's good to know that the double cannon is working, but for me right now, I need to upgrade, uh, I need some, I need some uh, more army camps. Here we go, we got enough for more, another army camp. Okay, that's what I needed, that's what I needed right there. Army camps going down for, for, four gems. Okay, that means I can, um, we can't upgrade anymore. Okay, so that means we can get more units now to bring into battle. Let's, uh, I'm gonna go all out with the, uh, with the barbarians. Because eight barbarians is super... Super strong at this low level builder hall. So uh, when you want to when you want to upgrade things guys You have to choose between sneaky archer or the rage barbarians um, Upgrading don't upgrade them both because you'll run out of resources I feel like you need to upgrade one thing at a time because the game ends up being uh, boxer giants and then baby dragons so uh, you kind of forget about your rage barbarians or sneaky archer so I'm gonna Choose the Rage Barbarians because they're super strong. That that Rage effect is awesome. And I find these Sneaky Archers a little bit, uh, you know, flimsy later on. Um, they're really good for destroying structures around the outside though. But getting deeper into the base is a little bit tougher later on. So let's go ahead and do some more attacks. Oh, goodness me. Alright, we got Serdosi. Alright, he's got... We should be able to own this. Let's, let's just mass attack uh, that... There we go. Oh, that push trap. Oh, no. All right, the push trap kind of ruined my day there. Let's see if we can get this builder hall down quickly. Come on. Come on, barbarians. Get, focus onto that cannon. We got the two star at least. Can we get this can cannon down before he knocks out both of my barbarians? <gasps> no, we're not going to get 100%. Oh, okay. Let's see how he does. I am a little bit scared. Only got a, only got a one star, 45% out of that. Oh, my goodness. Where's the rest of the base? He must have spread it around, so he might- if he gets two star, I am in deep trouble. I wish you could watch it, like I wish you could watch while he's attacking, but I think that he's having trouble with the double cannon. Yes! Woo! That was close. Let's see- let's see that replay. Oh man. Oh man, let's have a look- let's have a quick look here. Alright, let's- uh, so yeah. Okay. Double cannon doing that some work. So double cannon is your friend. You need to have that double cannon as soon as possible in the low builder hall levels because that's what's ever that's what's going to give everyone troubles at that stage okay so um let's have a look at some defenses we can get an archer tower now so it's all about getting those defenses down as well um as soon as you can afford them um here we go let's put that over here all right we're starting to look like a like a real base now um let's put that here because the archer tower does actually have a lot of range. I really want to get rid of the stone. It's kind of annoying, but you need uh, you need builder hall level three to get rid of the obstacles, I believe. So uh, let's not wait four minutes. Let's finish up with four gems. Not too much. All right. So we've got another th one attack there um, to get the bonuses. Let's have a look at the shop. What are you guys thinking? What's your favorite uh, defense right now? I love the double cannon. Can't wait to get more push traps. Push traps is my favorite trap, uh, even in the late game. So let's... Okay, so what we want to do is... Let's go here. We want to protect that push trap. So we want to push... Push away the troops as much as possible. Give it a fighting chance. And we're looking good. I, I feel confident. Let's go into the, another attack. And uh, let's get some more bonus. Some loot bonuses here. All right. So the way the attack is, all right, we need to get rid of the defenses. Let's go four on the archer tower and four. Oh no. Oh, okay. Okay. This could be bad. All right. Let's go for percentage now. I feel like we, go we need to go for percentage. Um, all right, let's go. Let's go to the laboratory. 56%. We've got the one star. I don't think we'll get the two star, but let's go ahead and follow the the legend of the last raged barbarian. Come on, come on! All right, let's see if we can get the build hall. Oh no, he's he's gonna be in the rage of the cannon. He's gonna die off. But the other guy needs to get a two star to to win against me. Otherwise, it's gonna be a high one star. So we're praying. We're praying. Yes, man, my defenses are really good. Um, he's got eight barbarians. But the thing, the key is that I have three defenses now. I've got the archer tower, and I'm protecting that double cannon. 
and they're just having no chance getting to that double cannon because the double cannon is shutting them down. He wouldn't even got the one star for the percentage there. Boom. So that's good. You gotta get the. It's the key is to win is get those defenses down as soon as possible and also attack the defenses first. You gotta find the parting towards uh, the the defenses. Otherwise, go for percentage around the outside and you've got it, son. You've got it. All right. I'm pumped. I'm pumped. All right. Let's go and uh, make sure that's. We've got, uh, let's gem that up. Let's have a look at any upgrades that we can do uh, defense-wise. Okay, nothing here. We can probably upgrade to Builder Hall 2 now. Um, that's going to be fantastic. So we've got a bit of loot to spend here, guys. So I'm deciding what I'm going to spend it on. Can we upgrade this? All right. All right, so I might upgrade the Star Laboratory, get those Barbarians um, more leveled up. So let's do that. Um, let's check if that's actually the case. Um, yes, I need level 2 star laboratory. Let's get the laboratory up. Um, I could upgrade the builder barracks. Let's, uh, but I don't really want the sneaky archers right now. Let's see if we can upgrade anything else uh, that's worthy. Um, let's upgrade the... Let's upgrade... Oh, we need builder hall 3. We need builder hall 3. Uh, can we upgrade the cannon? We can upgrade the cannon. And we can also upgrade the push trap. We do have enough gold, so... Uh, how much is it to... We need 30,000. Okay. Alright, we can spend... Okay, let's let's get to Builder Hall... Let's get to Builder Hall 2. We uh, 3. So we can start clearing these obstacles. Um, let's do that. So let's upgrade that. Oh, wait, uh, yep, yeah, we can do this. We can, um, we can just use the seven gems. So that's gonna take an hour. Um, I'm not gonna wait an hour, because I don't want to wait, wait for you guys an hour. I don't want to cut the video, alright? Yeah, there will be some cuts, but I don't want that. So, okay, so what can we get from Builder Hall 3 here? We got another army camp. We got elixir storage and the gold storage, which is cool. And we got some more defenses. Uh, we got another push trap. This is cool, looking cool. We got the crusher coming in as well. Uh, let's, uh, let's protect, let's give the archer tower a little bit more fighting chance. All right, let's move this wall a little bit further this way. Yeah. And what I want to do is keep the push traps, um, pushing away the, uh, how do I connect those? Okay. So I want to use both push traps here. So... Let's put the double cannon. And let's just push this away. Let's push this away from our double cannon. We've got to protect that double cannon as much as possible. A lot of people are complaining about the daily loot limit. Uh, so what the builder base is originally planned to be is to have something to do between war attacks and farming. So uh, we don't want to have too much time invested in the build base. I know a lot of people just want to just go through it really quickly and get to build a hall 5 ASAP get all the max troops without gemming uh, That's fine. It's supposed to be something to do in between war attacks and farming and uh, The the three loot bonuses that you get is quite considerable uh, It pretty much you can pretty much get lots of upgrades with the loot bonuses and come back when the cooldown is finished uh, so Let's try to spend this 44 elixir before we head out um, so what else, else is important here? Let's, uh, let's upgrade. Can we upgrade anything here? Let's, we probably can upgrade the gold mine. Um, let's have a look here. We need 180,000 for the next, uh, army camp. We can get a gold storage. Let's get the gold storage down. Uh, just so it also gives us a little bit more protection as well. Uh, let's see if this is in range of the Archer Tower. Yep, the Archer Towers. Look at the range of the Archer Tower. It's amazing. So that's it for the first episode of the Let's Play. Um, we're going to get through this base. We're going to max out these bases together. And I hope you guys join me on the journey. Make sure you comment below what your favorite troop is. And what trophy range you are at the moment. Smack that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. And remember guys, stay wicked. And follow me on Instagram.